This is the Extreme 8 Power Chair by Magic Mobility. This power chair is one of a kind. This is a four wheel drive power chair, a motor for each wheel. This chair has 700 watts motors per wheel. That's a total of 2800 watts of motors. So you have way too much power, but it's there. This is a power chair that you can use on the beach because of the, the wheels. These are 14 inch. These are 14 inch low pressure knobby tires. So if you're gonna go on the beach or anywhere with soft sand, this is the only chair that will go through that, that type of stuff unless you get a tank. Uh, but this power chair will do that. This chair also has, when you turn the wheels in front, if I turn, the wheels will turn with the, with the chair, okay? You can also lock those front wheels through the door so we can lock them where they stay straight. If you're stuck in the mud or something and you want four wheel drive, then the wheels will not shift and it, then once you're out of your trouble, then you can shift it back to where the wheels will turn when you, uh, when you go right or left. It also has the electric tilt and it also has electric recline, an electric tilt, electric recline. Uh, it also has the safety belt, the light, the light kit. Uh, as I said, this chair has 67 miles, so it's practically brand new, 67 miles. These are built like tanks, so they last, you can abuse these chairs, uh, and they last forever. Uh, this power chair is not good for inside of a home, so this is only an outside power chair because the turning radius is not that good and it's a very noisy chair because of the tires. It's made for outside, the beach, the woods, the trails, anywhere you want to go, it'll go. There's several videos on the internet telling you about this chair, where you can use it and people going through mud, snow, beach, uphill, downhill, it got, it's a great chair. So again, 67 miles. The first thing we're going to cover on this chair is the electric tilt. So you would work all the function through the joystick. So if you go here and you hit the mode button right here, until you see a picture of the seat, then you move the joystick sideways, and now when you have the seat all in black, that's your electric tilt. Then move the joystick back, and you can see your electric tilt going back. This is the electric tilt right here. The arms on this chair also will flip out of the way. So if you need to transfer from the side, you can transfer from the side and the arms will flip out of the way. So this is your electric tilt. We're going to bring the tilt back down. Always make sure that if you use the tilt on these power chairs, if you don't use your safety belt, take it off. Because what happens if you leave the safety belt, it will have a tendency to fall in the crack and wind up in the tilting motor and you'll damage your tilt. So if you're not going to use a safety belt, we'll remove it instead of having it sit back here and fall and go into the tilting actuator. So that's your electric tilt. The next thing we're going to do is the electric recline. So the recline on this one you push forward and your recline goes back. The nice thing about these recline, I was asking the company why do they have recline and the question I was asking the company who makes this chair is why does this chair still drive, like if I recline it all the way over here, and then I go back to driving, okay, the chair still drives full speed. I asked them why does it do that with the seat reclined, they said because when the seat is reclined like that, if you're going downhill, you're reclining the seat and you don't feel like you're going to come out of it. The same thing if you're going uphill, you can have it go forward. So you can drive this chair with a seat recline going down a hill, not feeling like you're falling out of your chair. So I'm going to go back to do the recline all the way down so you can see how far down it goes. So this is your full recline. So if you want to see what it looks like, that's what you're looking like if you be reclined. So that's uh, that's pretty much about an 80% recline there. So I'm going to bring the recline back up. Also on this chair you have what's called a swing away joystick. You can swing the joystick away from the front. That's called a swing away. If you're left handed we can put the joystick on the left side with no problem at all. And the left arm also comes up out of the way just like this one does. 
okay? So we're going to bring the recline back up. Then we're going to put the chair back in the driving mode. There we go. So now I'm going to put it on a little slower. There we go. We have headlights also in this chair. So if I turn the lights on, you'll be able to see the headlights. So these are the high package headlights, the expensive ones. So I'm going to turn the chair so you can see what they look like on the front. Those are your front headlights. <laughs> it's pulling my board out. So these are your rear headlights, your real lights, and I don't know if it has flashers or not. Oh, uh, it does have hazards, okay? Yeah, I'm not sure about flashers. Yep, it does have flashers. So flashers and headlights and everything. So it's got the nice lighting package on here. This chair here is, is about 28 inches wide. So from outside of wheel to outside of wheel is 28 inches wide. The total length of the chair is about 45 inches long. Um, also the foot plate in this chair The foot plate in this chair do flip up, so if you want to get in and out, you have cap pads here, there. You have your lighting system, and you can see the wheels turn. You want to turn the joystick. On the back of the chair, you've got a push bar here. You've got your tail lights here. You've got a bumper here. If you needed to put this chair in neutral, there's two levers right here that are above this bar. You push them down and then you can roll the chair in neutral. That's how you would push it in neutral. You have wheelie bars back here. If you happen to be too crazy, this will help you. You also have back here, uh, you can see your actuators here, two actuators for the, for the electric seat. Uh, you have anchor point here and here. You have two here. So if you need to tie the chair down to your lift or to your van, that's where you would tie it. And you have two more up front. There's one here, and there's another one on the other side, right here, your anchor points. So this chair will go 6.2 miles an hour, top speed outside, 6.2 miles an hour. This chair will hold 400 pounds because it does not have the seat lift, so it has a 400 pound weight capability. So any user that 400 pounds or less can drive this chair. Um, as I said, this chair is a beast, 6.2 miles an hour. The distance on this, mile, on this chair is about 12 to 13 miles on a battery charge. So, so if you're looking for an extreme power chair where you want to go on the beach, dirt, sand, only to keep it outside, this chair, as I said, has 67 miles, so it's in new condition. It has the electric tilt, the electric recline, the legs are manual, it has two batteries. When you charge this chair, what you do is you take your battery charger, and you plug it right in the bottom of your charge of your uh, joystick, and as soon as the light turns green, fully green, you're fully charged. So it does come with a charger, owner's manual, nice high back, comfortable seat. Watch the video outside; you'll be impressed. This is a really nice one. It won't last long.
as you can see, I went through the ditch over here. Uh, no problem at all. This thing will go through anything. Uh, I wish I had some beach here. I could show you on the beach, but uh, just take my word, it'll go on the beach. Uh, fantastic chair, 6.2 miles an hour, electric tilt, electric recline, 14 inch, soft knobby tires, swing away joystick, 700 watt motors on each tire, so you have four 700 watt motors. Plenty of power, fantastic chair, ready to go. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We are a family owned business for over 25 years. We have many products available, not just what you see in this video. If you would like to learn more, you can call the number below at 800-677-6293 or you can visit us directly at www.marksmobility.com.